Hi everybody, my name is Jim Sprague. I'm the owner of Sprague Wood Turning, and today I've teamed up with Designer Epoxy to do a tutorial on how to mix and apply Artcast from Designer Epoxy. Designer Epoxy's Artcast is a one-to-one -one ratio mix. One part A to one part B, making it easy to measure, thus preventing mistakes. It is super clear and has the same UV inhibitors in it as Deepcast. Artcast also uses Blue Tech technology, making it highly UV resistant and provides high strength, preventing scratches, and it's super clear. It has no odor, no fumes, and is food safe once fully cured. It also has a medium viscosity for best control. Let's mix them up. All right, so this is the mixing container that we're going to use. I've taped this off so that we can focus in on this and so there's no mistakes, and you might want to do this as well. We're going to be using the one-to-one -one scale at the very top. Now, I'm going to be mixing some coasters today, and I think that what I'm going to use is the number three level. So I'm going to fill the first three with part A, and then top it up with part B to the second three. That way, you know that the levels are correct, and your epoxy will cure properly. All right, so here's... Part A. And now part B. Mixing time is three to three and a half minutes slow in one direction trying to prevent air bubbles while mixing. It's best to have a torch on hand or a heat gun to pop any bubbles that may come to the surface as well. It's also a good idea if the resin is cold to run some hot tap water and sink the two gallon jugs in it for about 20 minutes. This will allow perfect viscosity on those cold days. Just make sure that the water level is under the bottom of the caps and that they remain closed. It can be applied very thin or up to one inch in a single pour and is ideal for charcuterie boards, flood coats, arts and crafts, jewelry and tumblers and a lot more. So what I'm going to do is carry on mixing this and uh, we'll come back at the three and a half minute mark. All right, so that's been three and a half minutes. For my project today, I'm going to be using Sky Blue. And again, you can get these at Designer Epoxy as well. And I'm just going to put uh, a little bit in there and we'll mix it up and see if we like the color of it. One thing also, make sure that you scrape the side walls of your bucket and the very bottom of your container as well. Uh, if you don't, you'll, you might have some uh, uncured resin in those spots, so make sure that you do that as well while you're mixing. There, I'm happy with that. Let's get our molds ready. All right, so there is our beautiful resin ready to go. Let's pour it in our molds. There you go, almost the perfect amount. And all I'm gonna use is a torch like this to pop any bubbles that have come to the surface. What's great about Arcast is that it has a 45 to 50 minute work time and can be recoated in 10 hours and is fully cure in 16 to 24 hours. Hopefully you enjoyed the tutorial. 
To see more projects made with ArtCast, please head to my YouTube channel with the link provided below this video. Thanks.